neuro aesthetics, the neuroscience of art, and how we humans respond to art. I did not know, and I really want your thoughts on this. Back in the old Greek Stoic era of Socrates, Plato, and Epictetus, and those guys, a physician would show up. I'm not sure what they called them in those days. I think physician is right. And if you had a particular malady, they would prescribe poetry. Go figure, right? And the poetry was believed in that era to have curative powers. In the same way we know that if you go to a museum or if you create art, your brain functions at heightened levels. So it really is a question in this post. What do you think of this notion of poetry as a curative tool for a wellness regime. If story can change the biology in humans and make oxytocin flow and make you feel more empathetic or make cortisol flow because you're frightened and the amygdala is engaged and you want to run away or fight. It's something I'm contemplating because I think with AI on the horizon getting more and more powerful every day. Um, is poetry and art a way to for us to maintain our humanness? Let me know what you think. I'm thinking about it. I don't quite have the answer. I'd love to have your help. Until then, good morning to you. And uh, good morning, sunshine. Bye for now.